Hello, 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 my lovely gems, and welcome back to Gems Life Live. We're going to get into some things. Hello, my lovely gems, and welcome back to the channel. Make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. So sadly, we are talking about little TJ today, and he actually was in a shootout. Um, First, they said it was at a Chipotle in Jersey. Then they said it was at a gas station, Um, but it has come out via academics, shout out academics, that it was actually at his hotel, and the two suspects have been arrested, and well, a as well, his friends, um, they actually pulled out and shot back. So um, they have been arrested as well. Little TJ is actually coming out of surgery. I don't know if you know Hassan Campbell, the YouTuber, but he's actually speaking to Little TJ's mom directly. Little TJ is, is a Bronx rapper, as you know, and Hassan is from the Bronx. So that totally makes sense. So he's getting um, information directly from the family. He said that he's out of surgery, but he's still unconscious and his lungs are collapsing. So hopefully he can pull through prayers to his family. Um, There's been a few uh, different celebrities come out. French Montana, pray for a little TJ. Um, A few others. Um, The one that stuck out because I just did a video uh, a couple days ago about Ruby Rose and little TJ kind of reconciling. Um, I didn't think they were an item, but if anybody did, I would say no, because she was still posting like her birthday celebration. She did say pray for little TJ, but I feel like a girl that's like in a relationship or completely invested in someone intimately like that would be like right by his side and like not really posting birthday festivities. And she also posted for a uh, wire fest. She'll be on that in London. So I just feel like anybody thinking that they're like an item, I don't think they are. So yeah, shout out to little TJ. I hope you pull through. I mean, it's so crazy out here. You have to be careful because, you know, it's hard times right now. We're going in a recession and COVID just ended and uh, people haven't been working and they're not giving out those checks anymore, those CERB checks. So, you know, people are out here and they're hungry and they're going to do what they can to uh, get up on you, especially these rappers. They end up being targets. So just be careful out there and just know how you're moving and move properly. You know what I'm saying? So anyway, other than that, Going on to Ruby Rose, she will be at the Wire Fest. She just posted it, and that's going to be Cardi B on the Friday, SZA on the Saturday, and Nicki Minaj on the Sunday. So if you're in London, England, you're going to want to go see that. It's going to be really, really dope. Um, Nicki's tickets sold out right away. <laughs> Cardi's tickets have not sold out yet. So interesting, 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 interesting. Um, also in Canadian news, uh, the real diamond Duchess on her Instagram, it is her birthday. So happy born day to you from gems life. She's a Canadian Toronto rapper and she's doing her thing. So wish her happy birthday. If you know of her and like her music. And then also I wanted to shout out nemesis, the video director, um, also the creator and director of push the YouTube TV series. He was just saying to salute to all the females that are out there getting their bag, doing their thing. And that was just a little inspiration for the females out here doing their thing. So that was really cute. So thank you for that. Shout out Nemesis. And also, I wanted to talk about a bill that is passing in Canada right now in Ontario. Pierre, or not Pierre, Pierre's his dad. Um, Justin Trudeau, who is our prime minister at the moment, Um, he is passing a bill that has to do with algorithm on the internet for Canadians, Bill C-11 through Parliament, and that is passing. And what that's going to do is they're going to be able to control what we see on the internet. So I don't know if you guys are aware of like China, places like China, they control the internet. So if you say anything bad about the government or you can't go on certain platforms, YouTube, Instagram, they're not allowed any of that. 
much like in Russia too now. They banned uh, Instagram and how even uh, uh, Trump was trying to ban TikTok in the United States there for a little bit. So I don't know if you guys understand how like monumental this is. Um, it's basically the ability to rewrite the algorithm um, in Canada on the Internet. So that is crazy. And uh, we need to watch out for that. <laughs> so please be up on your politics. I know a lot of people probably don't vote or they probably think it's rigged so they don't even bother. Uh, but I think we really need to start voting on like a, you know, a local stat, like local status, like even just in your city, your township, your um, region, uh, just to get some of the leaders you know, to be more aware of what's going on out here and so that we have more control over what's happening for our future in our nation. So anyway, I just wanted to make sure you guys were aware of that. And let me see, is there any other news? Um, no, I don't think there is. Uh, 6 9 was just being a jerk, laughing at Lil TJ. And he's just an idiot because he's a rat and he should just watch himself. He totally just taunts these rappers. And it's like, you know, karma's going to come get you. And that's just not good. So he needs to slow it down because he's doing the most. And I mean, I think academics needs to tell him. I'm sure he has. But I think he needs to really sit him down and be like, yo, like, you need to chill. Because, like, you're not very popular out here right now. And secondly, nobody likes you because nobody likes a rap. Okay. Um, also, Sweetie has put out her new Crocs collection, and they're so nice. Um, it reminds me of when Nicki Minaj posted herself in Crocs that were all blinged out, and she did that a long time ago. So I don't know why she didn't take advantage of this, but she should have because she pretty much just needs to wear something and it sells out. But yeah, Sweetie did it, and they're very nice. I have to admit, I really like them. So you can go on her page on Instagram, and there's a link there to the Crocs if you really like them. So anyway, that's all the news today. Please comment, like, and subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you can be aware when I drop another Gems Life Live. Bye for now, my lovely gems.